Travel Robot Presence Hey, in this video we are going to talk about the top 10 things to do in Oklahoma. Oklahoma is an authentic gateway to the West, a land of red dirt, where buffalo roam the plains and oil rigs pump riches. But the largest cities, Oklahoma City and Tulsa, also have a distinctly refined air, having been built on the proceeds of an early 1900s oil boom. Modern museums, galleries of international art, and lavish gardens, among other cultural attractions, all give the state a more cosmopolitan edge. But many tourists choose to experience Oklahoma with the simple pleasures of a road trip. And no highway is more iconic than the state's stretch of Route 66. So before starting this video, subscribe to our YouTube channel for future updates. Let's get started. Number 10. Oklahoma City National Memorial and Museum On April 19, 1995, a tragedy rocked Oklahoma when Timothy McVeigh and accomplice Terry Nichols committed the deadliest act of domestic terrorism in U.S. history. McVeigh's homemade bomb, stashed in a rented truck, killed 168 people in and around the Alfred P. Murrah Federal Building in downtown Oklahoma City and injured several hundred more. The Oklahoma City National Memorial and Museum remembers and honors the victims and survivors of that horrific day. Visitors can view photos, biographies and stories of those impacted by the bombing, as well as read about the heroic efforts by citizens, first responders and leaders from around the nation who came to the aid of survivors buried in the wreckage and helped the city and state heal. Visitors call the memorial and museum a sobering experience, but say the stories are told respectfully. If you don't have time for the museum, number nine, Oklahoma City Museum of Art. About half a mile from the bombing memorial in Oklahoma City sits one of the region's leading art institutions. The Oklahoma City Museum of Art has an impressive range of exhibitions, from paintings and photography to glass pieces and sculptures from around the world. Though its specialty is American art and post-war abstraction, a state-of-the-art theater offers on-site film screenings on certain days throughout the year for an additional fee. Many past visitors have specifically called out the museum's collection of Dale Chihuly's glass masterpieces as a highlight. The museum doesn't have its own parking lot, so you may need to find a paid public parking space. If you want to stay nearby and take in yet more art, you can't go wrong with the 21C Museum Hotel Oklahoma City, a former car assembly plant turned into a stylish boutique hotel that houses its own contemporary art gallery inside. Number 8. Visit Bricktown. Located in the heart of downtown Oklahoma City, Bricktown is a dining and entertainment district set within a restored warehouse neighborhood. This popular destination is located on a canal that links Bricktown with downtown and the Oklahoma River. While here, travelers can dine at a variety of restaurants and nightclubs, including the Mantle Wine Bar and Bistro, which serves new American cuisine, and the Bourbon Street Cafe. For activities and socializing, Heyday Entertainment has bowling and an arcade, while Brickopolis has a multi-level laser tag experience where participants hunt aliens, plus an outdoor putt-putt course, climbing wall, and bungee trampoline. There's also an array of shops for a little retail therapy, and the Chickasaw Bricktown Ballpark with minor league baseball games and Oklahoma Sports Hall of Fame are steps away. Number 7. Gathering Place this free riverfront park in Tulsa unfurls across more than 65 acres, and the city has plans to expand it to 100. Gathering Place boasts more than 100 unique experiences, including an adventure playground, climbing structures, suspension bridges, slides, puzzles, a sensory garden, a reading tree, a picnic grove, and many other attractions. If you're planning a day at Gathering Place, you don't even need to leave for meals. Instead, visit one of the three restaurants within the park. There's also an opportunity to enjoy the flora and fauna of Oklahoma. With 400 species of plants, 16 acres of wildflowers and animals such as great blue herons, squirrels, turtles, bats, owls and more. Past visitors call the park a Tulsa gem and highly recommend it for families with children. If you're planning on staying the night in the city, the Ambassador Hotel Tulsa, autograph collection less than two miles from the park is highly rated for its amenities and dining. Number 6. Oklahoma City Zoo and Botanical Garden 
The Oklahoma City Zoo seeks to let guests connect with wildlife, and as such you'll be able to see around 1,900 animals throughout the zoo's 140 acres. In addition to regular admission, there are a number of activities you can pay extra for, including the chance to ride a camel, feed a giraffe or rhino, explore a one-of-a-kind exhibit of toy brick animals, or take a safari cart tour. Also, for an additional fee, the zoo offers up-close encounters with grizzly bears, bison, Indian rhinos, Galpagos tortoises, sea lions, and Asian elephants. You can sit down for a meal at a handful of restaurants within the zoo, though some of the options are seasonal. Number 5. Wularuk Museum and Wildlife Preserve Less than 50 miles north of Tulsa, Wularuk Museum and Wildlife Preserve was initially a ranch retreat built in 1925 by oil baron Frank Phillips. The 3,700-acre space is now a wildlife preserve, home to bison, elk, longhorn cattle, and many other species. The museum offers a unique display of Western art and artifacts such as sculptures, ranch memorabilia, and old photographs. In addition to a Colt firearms collection and Native American pieces that span pottery, art, baskets, blankets, and beads, Travelers call the preserve a pleasant surprise that offers something for just about everyone who visits. If you're planning to stay near the preserve, consider the Hilton Garden in Bartlesville or the Hampton Inn Bartlesville. Number 4. Beaver's Bend State Park. Located in the southeast corner near Broken Bow, this nearly 3,500-acre state park is one of the most popular natural areas in Oklahoma. Outdoor adventurers will have plenty of activities to choose from, including hiking, mountain biking, horseback riding, river floating, and more. At Broken Bow Lake, you'll have opportunities to fish, boat, water ski, canoe, and even scuba dive. You can even bring your golf clubs and play the Cedar Creek Golf Course. Some of the other activities include volleyball, mini golf, and tennis. Visitors can stay in one of the park's cabins, RV sites, or almost 400 campsites. There's also a lodge on the shore of the lake that you can stay in. Visitors say the park is clean and beautiful, with plenty of scenic views while you're off the grid. For other entertainment, nearby Hockatown offers a variety of family-friendly amusements including bowling and trail rides. What's more, the town has ATV, slingshot and power sports rentals, along with Hockatown restaurants and additional lodging. Number 3. Oklahoma History Center Although Oklahoma has plenty of museums where you can learn about different aspects of the state's history, you won't want to miss the Oklahoma History Center. This Smithsonian affiliate provides a comprehensive look at the state's history of Native American culture, pioneers, aviation, commerce, and more. Even before you enter the museum's doors, you'll be able to take a quarter-mile walking tour of the gardens, where you'll get a sample of Oklahoma's terrains, trees, flowers, and plants, there are also various statues, an oil and gas park, a Vietnam-era helicopter, and other attractions on the museum grounds. Inside the museum, you'll learn about the history of free enterprise in the state, astronauts and aviators, Oklahoma's early settlers and development into a state, and more. Visitors say that the Oklahoma City Museum offers an excellent, holistic look at the state's history and can leave you with a deeper appreciation of Oklahoma. Number 2. Oklahoma State Capitol. The Sooner State's Capitol building is unique in that it's the only state capitol surrounded by working oil wells. Guided tours, which last about 45 minutes, can walk you through Oklahoma history and the building's Greco-Roman architecture, but you'll want to schedule them in advance. You can also take a self-guided tour of the more than 100-acre property with the aid of a brochure. In addition to 650 rooms, the Oklahoma State Capitol houses murals, restored stained glass, art exhibits, and a tribal flight plaza. Visitors say the building's artwork is impressive and the guides are very knowledgeable. Number 1. Science Museum Oklahoma Science Museum Oklahoma in Oklahoma City is known for its hands-on approach to teaching science, art, and history. Children can wander the 20,000-square-foot curiosity and learn through interactive activities. The Kirkpatrick Planetarium features shows exploring the cosmos that are included with your admission to the museum. This institution has a range of other exhibits with opportunities to learn about your body's heat patterns, 
decorate and color an animal in a digitally simulated forest, and more. Past guests say that while it's especially worth visiting if you're traveling with kids, guests of all ages will appreciate time spent here. If you love similar content like this, take a look at my other videos. And if you like it, please smash the like button and make sure you subscribe to the channel and hit the notification bell. If you have further questions, feel free to comment down below. See you in the next video.